Alrighty then, folks. Black Cross here. Welcome back to Final Fantasy 2. Well, for those that didn't catch it a second ago, my characters are all fixed up and ready to go. We are going to take on the final area. However, there are two things that need to be noted. Number one. This is going to be the longest dungeon I've ever went through because technically there are two parts to this dungeon. The first one being that of the Jade Passage, and then the second one is the Pandemonium, which is the final area leading to the Emperor. So, if we're all set, I am. Alrighty, we're going to go ahead and get this started, and I'm hoping that this dungeon isn't too awful bad to where we can figure it out relatively decently. I'm not saying that we're going to figure this out right off the back, but I'm hoping things won't be too awful bad. Also, I don't know if I should start collecting items or not, considering the fact that some of them are less useful than others. Whoa, oh shit. Um, okay. Whatever works for you. And Ultima is at 7 now. So we're doing quite a bit of damage. Just not a lot of damage right off the bat. Okay, so it's not too bad. Nope. Unless there's an elixir, I probably shouldn't try. Okay, that leads to the next floor. There's one right there. That gum. Maybe it's not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Of course. That's a false sense of security, I bet. <laughs> As I get deeper, I guarantee you, I'm gonna find out real quickly that, uh, unfortunately for me, it's going to kill me. Okay. Thought he was poisoned for a second, but he's not. But so that's good. Oh, of course. Empty room. I actually thought this was gonna be like a quick getaway. Nope. Game's like, nope, nope, don't 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 think it's too easy just yet, you'll die. Probably a good thing I did bump my characters up a little over 4,000. Something like that would definitely be a nuisance to me.
try to heal myself a little bit at a time. If I can. Especially since Leon's cure is only at like 7, while everyone else is at 11. So it's like, that gum. At least Maria's HP is growing. That shit's at 4. I thought it was at 7. And we'll reach to 7 before this is over with, though. Okay, this is weird. Cat's Claw. Hello. I think Leon is better stick to like trying to buff everybody up. I guess it's at least buffed up a bit. That's good. Really? Don't miss this. Ouch. Just, 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 just ouch. Okay, good. <laughs> that was unexpected. I hate these things. They can be a little bit annoying. Hopefully this might be the right way. Wrong way. There can only be so many wrong ways. Like eventually I will find the right way. And I do. It's gonna be nice.
Okay. Eventually we'll find the right way. Oh gosh. What are those? That's not good. We're meeting some new enemies. Thankfully they're not that strong, but at the same time, the fact that I don't know what they're capable of, that's what scares me. <coughs> it scares me knowing the fact that I don't know what they can do. It's like, they could probably do the worst to me. What does that do? Guess we'll never know. <laughs> Okay, good. Not good. <laughs> we need to kill those things... Now. Cause let's put it this way. The... Imps were a pain. Pit Fiend, I believe, would be even worse. If not dealt with soon. Okay, Gus. You can keep doing that. I think we might want to attach you with the second axe. When we get close to, uh, the Emperor. And that way... He'll die quicker. That gum! I think we're being a little bit unfair at this point. <laughs> and again, I don't think it matters. The better we are, the easier things are gonna get. That waterfall hurt me. Why? Why did the waterfall hurt me? I guess the ties must be too strong or something. Gotta be one of the two. Doubt it, but didn't think so. Didn't think that was the right way. But you never know. If I even avoid it just once, I'm gonna end up going completely mad and it's like, where is it at? And then I realize, oh, it's the one that I actually avoided. It's that one type, wouldn't it? Is that the one door I decided, you know what? This door looks like it's going to be completely useless to me. I'm not even going to bother entering in it. And sure enough, it's the door I need to go through.
Ah, we get one of those type of doors. A oh, runic, huh? Help! We're gonna try Ultima and see how powerful that is. Worst case scenario, it's not that powerful. And if that's the case, then we'll just have her try to get everyone buffed up. Along with Leon, too. That's not as strong as I would've liked to have been. Okay, bring us bed up. Okay, good. The two main attackers are buffed. There it is. Okay, good. Headband, huh? Helps to focus on that. Oh yeah, that's right. Someone was telling me that there's an equipment called headband that will prevent you from getting confused. Thank goodness we haven't run into that here yet. But it's nice to have that just in case. Just as a extra precaution, you know. Thought so. I was like, mm, just in case. Sure enough. Like, why do I even bother? I'll tell you why I bother. Because you never know what I'll end up finding. At least the good thing is that everybody else's agility is going up. So, you can't be too mad, right? Oh dear God.
Okay, Ultima rose up to eight now. That's good. Let's see. There are three doors. It's like, which one, which one? Which one is the correct one? regular enemies just have a high magic resistance and that's why they're not taking as much damage. <coughs> then again, cure magic is so far up to the level so I say it's just that low. I'm not even sure what the max level is for magic. Like the individual magic spells themselves. I don't know. I figured it would be the middle one, but it's not. Okay, it was the last one. Also, I'm just realizing right now that my clock is completely wrong. <laughs> and I started to realize now that that's, uh, the second hand is completely still. So in other words, batteries is dead. So I might want to consider changing that whenever I get done here. Because I happened to have looked up and I was like, it can't be 3 a.m. And uh, it's looking at it and it's like, oh. It just stopped. Okay, why well have a room in the middle? That is just a little annoying. Oh, that gum. Okay, there's another one. cruel to animals or something. <laughs> the way it acts. There go. Ah! 
Really? You stopped me right at the treasure chest? Fine. That one still managed to live. But not for long. And now you're dead. Let's see here. Better heal everyone while I still can. It's like the one time that I actually get a room of treasure chests. Here we go. Oh, this one's a red dragon. Ooh. I'll try to get... He's the only one that didn't get haste on him. How do you manage that? Okay, how the hell is that missing so badly? If either of these two misses, something's wrong. There we go. Ah, ouch. There we go, that gives us a little bit of boost. That did absolutely nothing to it. Okay. No need to have two holy lances. Ah, another door. Okay. We'll try that one now. And there can only be so many times you're wrong.
critical hit, why don't ya? <laughs> Okay, good. This is the right way. Twister? Okay, that's not as bad. Unless all six of them use it. Or five, I can't count for some reason. Ouch! That hurt! Okay, this twister shit is starting to get annoying. That was a critical hit right there. Okay. Everyone's HP went up practically. I'll be dead soon. <laughs> There's only one, so... Yeah, it's, it's good. It's dead. Okay, high potion. That ain't bad. Why did I think that room was going to be anything but an empty room? And that's why I don't like these empty rooms. Because they're full of ambushes. Oh crap.
Okay. They are slowly dying. Keyword being slowly. Like there's another door down there. Hopefully that's the right one. I hope it is. Like, please let that be the right door. Almost through. Although I don't know how much further, but I do believe we're getting close to being done with the first half of this dungeon. Because like I said before, the first half is the Shade Passage, and then the second half is Pandemonium. It's like we should be getting close. Unless we're already at Pandemonium, in which case it feels like it. Although for it to be the Underworld, because that's what Pandemonium is, is the Underworld, it doesn't look that bad. Not yet, anyway. That's not to say that will ch not change, because it will change. Here we go. You have entered Pandemonium. Yes. We have finally entered in Pandemonium. This is where sayings are gonna get harder. There are some good news, however. I have not used a single elixir. I still have all of my elixirs, which means if I end up being in a tight spot where I have no MP and I absolutely have to use it, then I will use it. Until then, I want to hold off from using it as much as possible, even if it means switching Gus and Kieran back and forth. Like I said, Maria, I need to try to get her level grind for Ultima. Or at least try to anyway. That doesn't mean it's going to work very well, but... At least try to.
I can see where this is going. A whole bunch of dead ends. That's all they can do, just three damage. That ain't much. Also, I know that Fearin's a little bit uh, lacking in terms of health. There you are. Those guys are dangerous. I mean, Death Rider is in the name. HP for them to be able to do that much damage and then take that much HP from me. Oh, that's insane. For the love of crime and Christmas. I think I need to kill those guys first. Because they don't know that they can do that much damage to me. A fair assessment. I died there. That worked. I 
I'll take those ethers. I'll take them. Okay, kill the Death Rider now. Like, all focus of attacks need to be towards the Death Rider. Like, kill him as fast as you can and prevent him from attacking us. Okay. Panic free now. Floor 2 of Pandemonium. I do not know. Oh, crap. Oh, shit. Okay. Panic time is over. Absolutely nothing. That is. Okay. That worked right off the bat. Ouch. Oh, well, never mind. He's dead now. Okay, it's time to use my Firk's Elixir. I want to level his up as best as I can. Wonder what's up here. I I have to know what's in there. Because chances are there's probably something good in it. Probably not, but there's something good in there. More than likely.
Okay, someone needs to kill that thing now. I got lucky with that one. I got an elixir. Okay. Aether. We're getting we're getting some good items out of this. Uh, take the red pill. Your first two comments, my friend, are first, and take the red pill. G good on you. Okay. Um, yeah. I did not realize I was that low. Wooden spoon. <laughs> oh, gosh. You're gonna flood the whole comments with random comments, aren't you? I'm, I'm, I'm waiting to hear what the next one is. I, 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 I did nothing right there. Yes, you are. Yeah. Figured you would. Figured you would. Be entertaining for a while. How have I been? I've been doing really good, actually. I mean, we're already on the verge of beating Final Fantasy 2, if... I was about to say, if we can get through this one. <laughs> we're getting a lot of good items now. Speaking of which, we need to use one of those elixirs. Wouldn't hurt to go ahead and give one to Gus. Cause his MP was looking pretty low too. Entertainment forever. Of course you could. Yeah. A portal? Are we... Are we already there? Like, are we already there? on the verge of beating him. Like, that's a shock. I figure Pandemonium would be a little bit longer than that. Like, the Jade Passage was actually longer than... I guess this. Because so far this is the second floor. And there was four floors for... Um... The, um... The Jade, the Jade Passage. Wooden Spoon! Okay, so pandemonium still continues. Okay. Leon, you're just not hidden now. It's super ineffective. Yes. Super ineffective. Super ineffective. Okay. Never mind. Didn't think there was anything over here, but... Thank goodness none of that is actually affecting me.
There we go. Okay. So that area is a dead end. That one's dead. That one's a dead end. There's another portal. Are those Medus? 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 No, those are Lemonin. Le Lemony? Lemony? Hard for me to figure out how to pronounce the proper uh, phrase, but they're basically uh, snake women. They're not Medusas. If that's what you're trying to say, Medusas. Because otherwise, if they turn me to stone, that would suck! In record, I've got plenty of golden needles, but turning me to stone would not be fun today. What it wouldn't, it wouldn't be fun. So they are Gorgons. Yes, they, they are a form of Gorgons. Ouch. I bet if you give that golem a ring, he will ha- he will leave. Give him a ring and he'll leave. It- it- it would be nice. It- it would be- I- I swear, that has to be a reference. Cause it's not Gallum. It's not Gallum from Lord of the Rings. It's golem. There, there has to be a reference in that one. I feel like I'm... I feel like I'm stupid for not knowing that. Whatever the case may be. It is. It's a play on words, bro. Bet if you mean to that now. Okay, I gotcha. Play on I gotcha now. I gotcha. Do I dare? It's a dead end. Wasting my time over there. I was like, is there a treasure over there? And there's a puzzle. Oh gosh. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna buff Furin. We're gonna buff him up. Like as of right now. We're not really doing that much damage. So if I can bop up, there he goes. He's a little bit more powerful.
Not a lot, but... Cure 6 sounds like a 90s rock band. Cure... Actually, you're right, it kind of does. Cure 6. It does kind of sound... It's a nice ring to it, actually. It's an interesting ring, actually. <laughs> Down that one goes. Alright, let's go ahead and get everybody fixed up. We're going even deeper. That area seemed awfully weird. We're already here now. That's what she said. <laughs> That's what she said. Nice. Oh, okay. She said that too. <laughs> 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 oh gosh. <laughs> okay. Go for the first one. Hmm. Hopefully, I'm going the right direction. And you can only go the wrong direction for so many times. This castle has a major rat problem. Not sure if you can consider those as rats, considering technically in terms of like the Final Fantasy universe, they're basically a tiger panther form, I suppose you could say. But they are a nuisance. Like, I I'm not going to say that they're not rats, but at the same time, they're about as much of annoyances as a rat, because they don't hit that hard, nor are they very effective. So it's like, sort of like a dink, 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 dink. Sort of like that, <laughs> can't believe I'm going to be using this, but the wooden spoon. They're freaking rats. <laughs> uh, okay, they're rats. Oh, 
Excuse me. Did one of those attacks say Blink? Uh, yeah. Blink is basically a... How can I explain Blink? Blink basically allows you to speed up. Of course it did. Nothing says there no danger than shutting your eyes. <laughs> right? Basically the phrase being, If the enemy can't see me, I can't see it. Ugh. Hey, that's a new one. Of course, it's not much of a threat, so never mind. Just curious as to what's in that chest. Genji gloves. So I got one of the good uh, armor sets. Zombie. Morgan? Okay. Let's see how long you last then. Wait, zombie board? Oh wait! That's that one pirate that I killed towards the beginning of the game. Okay, well never mind then. We know who you are. We know who you are. And just like that you're dead. That's interesting. I like that. You French chameleon killing pirates. That's funny. Super West India Trading Com- I appreciate that. I, I, I appreciate that. Stupid West Indian Trading Company. <laughs> uh, I, I appreciate that reference right there. Uh. I'm at a dead end now. You know they are the reason we don't have pirates anymore. Yeah, that much I do know. Okay, good. That's got that one out of the way. Okay, he's sped up now. Doing that. I keep thinking that Mario and Leon's, but I'm not. 
Okay, he's that up now. Okay. We now know that this part's a, uh... Blood Fiend looks like a dude in a bad devil costume. <laughs> Kinda does! In all honesty. But then again, um... Gosh, I can't even remember the guy's name. There was a boss that I fought earlier. Um... I think it was Gustaba? Gustaba? Something along the lines of that. But it's basically the same design, but instead of red, it's green. Or maybe it's orange. I don't know if that's red or orange. It looks red to me. But it's got like a little orange tint to it. They're not really that strong either. They're just like... Bleh. Second door we go. There needs to be a power called Jesus that gets rid of all devils in the castle. I'm not sure if devils would be considerate, but holy magic is strong against zombies, so I imagine maybe that would be it. Finally, that one's dead. Play the blue eyes white dragon. <laughs> uh. Wish I had that card. Be very helpful. Heck, the blue eyes ultimate dragon would probably help too. Okay, there we go. Or blue eye shining dragon. That's a good one. That's actually a really good one. That missed. Isn't there one, uh, one more above Shining Dragon? Blue Eyes, White Dragon, Blue Eyes, Shining Dragon, Blue Eyes, Ultimate Dragon. The only thing I could think of is, a uh, Red Eyes, Black Dragon. 
But at the same time, blue eyes, blue, blue eyes, white dragon, blue eyes, shining dragon, blue eyes, ultimate dragon. I'm not sure. If there is, I don't know. It's been a while, so I have no clue. Genji Helm. Hmm. Whoa. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, um, we might be in trouble. Oh, Toxin, great. He's gonna try to poison me. And it failed. It's King... King Godzilla. King Godzilla? <laughs> It's a three-headed dragon that always beats Godzilla. Oh! Is that what that is? I didn't know what the name was, but... Oh, okay. Now I know what his name is. That's what I thought. It's like, I remember seeing it. I just didn't know the name right off. Wasn't as bad as what I thought it was gonna be. Mm. Yeah, I've already got holy magic. Haven't really used it any either. I wanna check on my equipment though. Reduces my attack. But only by three. Increase my defense. I think I can risk that. Okay, so we've already been through that area now. I think there's only two more doors we need to go through, and eventually we'll encounter the right one. How's the crew? I haven't been up there in a while. Uh, well, it's been kind of... 
how can I put this? It's been kind of back and forth at work, what it has. It's, um... Um, well, I don't know if you've heard, but we're kind of going through, like, this mid-change thing. Obviously, you've heard about the whole Walmart situation of how, uh, everyone's getting a raise and everyone's getting certain bonuses. Well, they recently got rid of, uh, the, uh... I, I don't want to say any names because this will later on be up on YouTube. But uh, they basically got rid of the third shift uh, supervisor. And um, we got a new one. And um, they're basically trying to lower the number of thir third shift members. And instead try to grow second shift. But, uh, the growth of second shift, from the way it sounds, is not looking so good. Like, they're trying to, but it's not working out to their favor. And, unfortunately, from the way it sounds, it sounds like no one's wanting to leave third shift. Which, I mean, honestly, I don't want to leave third shift, but... From the way it sounds, it sounds like it's not going to be up to my decision, so... I mean, I haven't heard any more since they first talked about it. So depending on what happens within like the next two or three weeks from now, like I want to say within the next two or three weeks we'll know what's going to happen. But until then it's kind of like, it's kind of shaken up at the moment. There was a shakeup at my old store down here because a co-manager passed away. I'm sorry to hear that. I, I'm really sorry. I, I hate that that happened. Really, I hate that happened. Heart failure. I was one. I was about to ask. I was like, "What? Well, what was the cause of this heart failure?" Okay. Oh crap! Yeah, go figure. Who's gonna try to blind me? I saw the same boss in God of War 2. Kinda does actually, doesn't she? Hmm. He will try it and see if he manages to hit her, but I doubt it. Whoa! That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Yeah, that's a lot of damage.
Do a barrel roll. Yeah, I wish I could. That's not good. I can handle that. <laughs> uh, the, the the comment that you say is ka and then may ha may ha I doubt it, but we're gonna try it. Oh, Leon's dead. Would have been fun if it actually worked. I got her poison. Would it be best? Would it be best at this point? Yeah, the Kamiyamiya wave would be... Oh wait, you had a comment before that one. Wooden spoon. It would be best at this point. <laughs> Ugh. If I can get her to do enough stupid moves to where she can't heal herself, like using spells, that would save me. But then she goes for the regular attacks, which I can barely hold on my own.
That's over for guess. Okay, that's got two others. Now that's got all three. There we go, that was a critical hit right there. Magic missile. <laughs> yeah, give me something to kill it with. My only hope now is to try to increase my acceleration to where she'll end up missing entirely. It's like at this point right now, I am running out of steam. Okay, two of them are self-rated. This is what your fairy... This is what your fairy turns in if you don't... Hey, listen! <laughs> so in other words, that's what, uh... That's what the fairy will turn into if we don't listen to her. Oh, lovely! Yeah, just beat the living shit out of us! I don't know who's running out of steam. Uh, Azeroth or us? Ugh. That or a chicken wheel? That's, that's one hell of a chicken. Oh my gosh. That is one hell of a fight. Whew. 
gosh. Yeah, it's about time. I know, right? Like, holy shit. Like, when will it die? We've been at that fight for so long, I forgot which way I need to go now. Oh, we got new enemies! They're not that bad, though. That animation lasted way longer than it needed to. Ether. Nothing says fix your boo boo like sniffing. Sniffing knockout liquid? Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Um, okay, am I even going the right way? I hope I am. Now, Saber Wolf from Killer Instinct is in this game. Someone needs to be p paying some royalties or some shit. <laughs> Actually, they kind of did, didn't they? They kind of did look like Saber Wolf. Never even thought of that. Kind of do. Hmm. Of course, did. When did Killer Instinct first launch? When did it first launch? Well, I'm not sure. 1996. Hmm. Could be a color palette change uh, for, uh... You think? Oh, okay. That sounds about right, though, because... Didn't Killer Instinct first come out for the N64? Let me check. Okay. He's checking, guys. While you do that, I'm gonna kill some golems. Again. No, the SNES. Okay, so it came out for the SNES first. Okay. I'm not sure if the Fury... Fury, Fury, Fury. Those wolves, if they were that color palette in the original NES version, because technically this is the PS1 version. So I don't know if it was originally that color or not. No, 1994, the second one came out for N64, and, oh, okay, so the first one came out for SNES 1994, and then the second one came out for the N N64 in 96, okay, okay. If we could ever get through this fight. Oy. Well, we're getting somewhere. One died, finally.
Either way... Either way... Spinel is bay. Ah, okay. Sorry I've had to keep checking. It's, it's one of those things where it's like the I, N, and then like the A and the L try to combine together to make a different letter all together. But uh, if you'll excuse me for a moment, I'll be right back. I gotta use the bathroom. Enjoy some tunes while I'm gone. Okay. I have returned. Okay. Spinal. Spin. Spinal. Oh, spinal. Ooh. Spinal. Okay. Proper pronunciation. <laughs> Thank you for that. And go pee. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right then. Another warp pad. Okay. Whoa. Did anything come out? Did did everything come out all right? Yes, it come out just fine. <laughs> uh. Ooh, treasure chest. I gotta find out what's inside that now. Especially since the enemies aren't that bad. Those Death Riders was what was just hurting me so badly. Sage Winston. Okay. Oh boy, Ice Gigas. the ice figures. That's not too bad. That definitely was nothing.
the fact that they're not really that much of a threat. It's one of those like, that gummit already. Would you hurry up with your spells? Especially Fire 11, it takes forever to get through that one. Hopefully we haven't got much further. I mean, we're already on the seventh floor of Pandemonium, which is almost double what uh, Jade Passage was. At least I'm hoping we're almost there. Crunch? Is that what it is? Crunch? Cringe? Crunch? Unless you mean Ka. I need to clear out my inventory. Just keep finding some of- Some of these items are a little bit on the useless side. Some of them are somewhat useful, I suppose. Ninja Turtle Brain Fill- Oh, yeah! Krang! Okay, yeah, yeah. You know, come to think of it, I have not seen, uh, uh, the newest, uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie. The one that, uh, Michael Bay did. The first one was eh. But whenever I heard that, uh, that the two minions, uh, Bebop and, uh, Bebop and... what was the other one? Did you watch the 80s cartoon then? Yes, I did. Um, I remember watching it. I n can't say I've watched the entire series, but I have watched it. Rock that's what it was. Rocksteady. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe I forgot him. But, uh, I have not seen that movie. Um, is it pretty good? Or at, at, at least, is it as good as what the TV series would appreciate. I suppose is the phrase I'm should be trying to say. Like, is it as good? Am I out nerding you tonight? Out nerding me? It's a possibility. It's a possibility. <laughs> I I'm willing to admit. No, not at all. No, not at all as in like, it wasn't that good. 
or not at all as in like you're not nerding out more than I am or the point is you're ugh, you're so tongue twisted all of a sudden movie is not that great that's what I was afraid of well there's our blue dragon <laughs> Yeah, it's like with Michael Bay, I just got to a point where I didn't watch any of his movies. It's like, what was it? You know, the third uh, Transformers movie, I uh, decided to stop watching his movies entirely. And then, um, and then uh, after the uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, I was like, it's probably best just to not watch any of his stuff anymore. But, um, he's ugly. Yeah, the, the blue dragon is ugly. He'll be a dead ugly dragon soon. There he goes! He dead now. Better check on my team right now and see how everyone's doing. Get everybody fixed up. I don't know where we're at right now, but I'm sure we're somewhere. Get her fixed up. Tells me this might be a while. This big room. Oh, there's a fire gigas.
We should be getting close. Ah, there it is. Okay, this should be it. I think so. Let's take a look here and see what all I've got. Okay, this should be it. Or at least I think it is. I have no idea where he's at. What is that? Looks like an Amazon. Those are called Gigas. There's the Hill Gigas, the Ice Gigas, Fire Gigas, and Thunder Gigas. They're basically the strongest enemy in the game. Strongest enemy being that they have a higher resistance. So yeah! There he is. Okay. Real quickly. Okay, we're all set now. So good to see you again. This time, however, you are the ones who will die. So if they chew on you, would it be called a gigabyte? <laughs> I was afraid that this thing was gonna kill me, but I think you're gonna try to kill me of laughter. Uh, that was good. Look, this this Cthulhu <laughs> kind of does look Cthulhu-esque, doesn't it? Okay, everyone's got haste on. Kind of small weapon, isn't it? Beware, my twig of doom. Actually, compared to his size, yeah, his staff is like completely puny. Of course you would cast Curse on me. Spawn's cape is better. <laughs> oh boy. Maybe you need to be a part of this fight. Riffin on the boss. <laughs> that might do more damage.
I'm ripping on you. You're ripping on me? You're ripping on me! You're sniggering back there. Holy crap! That's um, that's a lot of damage. Don't use ice, he's already in ice. Use salt so he's <laughs> still- <laughs> Oh gosh. That's a good one. That's a good one right there. No matter what, and no matter what, don't stick your tongue on him. <laughs> I don't think none of us is gonna be doing that anytime soon. Let's see, I gotta think of something. He's not doing much damage to us, thankfully, but. He is kind of slowing us down. Okay, all of a sudden I'm not doing any major damage on him. Wooden spoon. <laughs> Probably more effective than what I'm doing right now. It can help pour the salt on his ice ass. <laughs> yeah. It
His right foot is already stuck. I mean, why not? Yeah? Hey, you, you... Yeah, you can't even see it. Starfall 10? Um... How badly is this gonna hurt? Not as bad as what I thought it was gonna do. Like, I thought that attack was gonna probably hurt me. Badly. Planetary Destruction. Yep. That's a move in Naruto. Planetary Destruction? Really? I mean, I haven't watched Naruto in... in a long while, actually. Like, I stopped watching it after the, uh... normal episodes, and then when it got ready to convert to the ship with him. Yes. Well, now. That's, um... That's one hell of an effect! It's the second strongest attack in a... of... attack of a Rengun user. Rasengun? Rengun. Rengun. Oh, okay. We in gone. Is it not? I thought I was pronouncing it right. Ring? R E N. Ring. Ring in gone. Ring in gone. With an N. Ren. Oh, Ren in gone. Right? Say rim. Rim in gone? Is that what it is? Rim in gone? Okay, rim. Okay. Okay. Well, that makes sense now. Yes, I admit. I admit to it. <laughs> so when did you stop watching? Like I said, I kind of stopped watching after I got done watching the regular Naruto. So I hadn't really watched any of the, uh, Shippuden episodes. I doubt it, but let's just see what Ice does to it. Sincerely doubt it'll do anything. Worst case scenario, we'll just tickle him.
Oh, it did something. But like I said, it only tickled it. So you don't know about how the elements work or how the Uchiha gets the sh gets the sharing gun. Yeah, I haven't gotten that far. How they get it just show how terrific that clan really is. Hmm. That sounds actually pretty interesting. Tragic. How tragic that clan really Is that what is that the word? Tragic? Sorry if I mispronoun okay, yeah, it is tragic. Sorry if I'm mispronouncing some of these words. Again with his move. It's okay. Okay, that's good to know. <laughs> Wait a second. That did something right there. We're gonna keep boosting his attacks. Oh crap! That 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 did a damage on him. Oh crap! Okay, immediate healing on Viren right now. I think he's running out of MP. Because he's just straight out attacking us. But the elements are, are cool because you get to see all new abilities and some are super cool. Huh. Guess I need to kind of check that, uh the Shippleton series out then, don't I? Like the dust element. Dust element? Okay. Whoa! He's dead! He's finally dead! <laughs> Not the coolest sounding. No, the dust element doesn't sound cool, but... Either way... We finally killed the Emperor! All I had to do was boost up my overall attack! Holy shit, I should have done that earlier. Ugh. Well, now I finally beat him. <clears throat> but, but why? Why can I not... I defeat you? Who are you? Let's get out of here.
sounds good with me. Let's see. But there is a move called Atomic. Dismantling that... Dismantling that tears the body apart to a molecule level. Huh. Interesting. I am glad you returned. You have done it. You are our heroes. You made it back. Amazing. I don't know whether you're brave or just lucky. Well, take care. He just did a twirl. Hey, I always knew you could pull that off. Drop by any time you see my ship. I'd be looking forward to seeing you again. You're our heroes. My father must be so proud of you two. I've decided to work here in the castle, serving the princess. It is the least I can do. Joseph? We will dedicate our lives to restoring what has been destroyed. We hope to see you again. Please take care. This dialogue is corny. Cornier than my poop. <laughs> it is corny, but considering the fact that the story w originated back during the NES days, it makes sense. Everything's ended. That's right. We can all live together again. All four of us. Right, Leon? We saw and learned too much. We can't go back to where we were before. Wait, Leon. Why? Furin, please don't let him go. What Leon said is true, Maria. I can't stop him from going. We shall meet again, Leon. Now let's go. This is going to be the real beginning. The long war ended at last. The Emperor N. Pandemonium and the monsters plaguing every corner of the world. They all vanished. Peace has finally returned. The people will slowly heal the scars of war. The memory of those Dismal day. Oh, Dad, Gamma, could you please slow down on the dialogue to where I can at least read it? <laughs> but one memory will remain clear and true. It was the original youth. Ordinary youth. Ugh. Gosh, I can't read. Final Fantasy 2. Let's see. You can say pandemonium, but you can't say Rasengan. Rasengan. Mostly because I've heard pandemonium so many times. It's one of those things where if I hear it enough, I know the proper pronunciation just by hearing it. Because the problem is, is that I read it, and if it's not familiar to me, I look at it as something completely different. I know, I know. 
But yeah, that's the ending of Final Fantasy 2. I finally beat Final Fantasy 2. Ugh. I have to admit, I definitely like the level up system within Final Fantasy 2. It's the problem is, is that unless you knew how to level up all of your stats, you really wouldn't get far in this game. But I really appreciate how they did the level of level up system in this one. It's very interesting. To me it is. But at any rate though, thank you so much for watching. Oh, what would you got there? You didn't show Leon any love. <laughs> Problem is he kind of showed up late in the game. I kid you not. He showed up like at the very end of the game. So it's kind of like it's kind of hard to. <laughs> you know? You expect me to pronounce that shit, huh? I I'm, I'm not even gonna try, okay? But I... The fear of long words. Yes! The fear of long words! If that's even a word. If that's a word. If, if that's a word, then... Ugh. Gosh. At any rate, though... That's the word for... That's the word for. That's the word for. For what? For the day? For the evening? That's the word for it. Okay. Fair enough. Anyway, though. That's gonna be it for this video. Uh, be sure to check out my YouTube channel if you haven't checked it out by chance. Uh, be sure to uh, go to my Twitter or Facebook to where you'll be the know when I am streaming. And, uh, yeah. I will see you in the next one. Tell them this is Black Cross signing off. And I'll see you later. Take care, guys.